Hello, Nintendo Chit Chatters. I'm Eddie Ray for NintendoChitChat.com. Welcome to episode 5 of Sushi Striker The Way of Sushido, out right now on both the Nintendo 3DS and the Nintendo Switch. Shoutouts to Nintendo for providing me a copy of the game. Last episode, we finished up Border Path 7. Today, we're heading into the SLF hideout. Stay tuned. <laughs> All right, guys, welcome back. Make sure you blast the like button for us. And yeah, so we finished up uh, Board Path 7 here, and we're heading to the SLF hideout. Show you the scene here. I did play it once before I lost, just kind of um, practicing off camera because I haven't played for a few days, so. Dang, nice digs. I'm glad you think so. Welcome to our hideout. This is your hideout, so who are you? My name is Masa. I'm the leader of a righteous band. Mm. So you're the one Jinrai chose. Uh -oh. I admit I hadn't expected him to grant his power to a child. Quit calling me kid! Better a kid than a rude jerk. Rude. <laughs> Perhaps you are right. I did neglect to properly introduce our outfit. We are the Sushi Liberation Front. SLF. A loose band of rebels biting back at the Empire. Whoa. Oh, you're against the Empire too. Then you gotta help me find Franklin. Please. The Empire got their mitts on him. He helped me, so we gotta help him. I see. Said the blind man. Very well. It's reasonable request. Yay! Under one condition. We'll do it. That you hand over Jinrai to our custody. Huh? What? <laughs> you see, Jinrai is an exceptional even among the upper echelon of sushi sprites. Far more than a child needs his plaything. Are you for real? No deal. I'll save Franklin myself if I have to. And I'll need Jinrai to do it. Hmm. hmm. I believe in that too. He said he wanted everyone in the world to have sushi, and I believe in that too. Fantastic Splendid. Job. Our goals align. Though in order to ensure it happens, we'll need you know who. That's not <laughs> Jinrai. Funny. You're pretty greedy for a so-called good guy. Why are you so obsessed with Jinrai? If you try to take him, you're no better than the Empire. That's true. What a pity. I had hoped you would see the reason. Don't take this personally. So it's on, guys. Yeah, so again, I practiced a little bit. I lost in the round here, so hopefully we can win on camera. Again, I didn't play for a few days either, so let's see if we can do it. They got three sprites, so they have the Electro Zap, Sushi Shield, and Runaway Lanes with those uh, skills. We've got Sweets Paradise and Bonanza for Jinrai and Penzo. Let's battle. Here we go. We want those combos. Let's go. Come on. There we go. Took him out. All right. So I didn't actually use my Sweets Paradise there, but we held off and uh, took our time. A little bit patient there in the middle of the battle. All right, good battle. So a little bit of practice there beforehand before I recorded was a good thing. Rank of A, good job. So, we get all those stars, that is great. Got a skill charm, boom, and experience points. You're not taking Jin right now, buddy. I 
see. I acknowledge your skill very well. I withdraw my claim on Jinrai. But in return. Can I rely on you to work with us? Our interests are aligned, after all. Mm, I guess. They're bidding to execute uh, their sushi stranglehold scheme. You and your sushi sprites. Would be valuable or invaluable allies in putting a stop to it. What? They already have almost all the sushi, and they want even more. I can't stand them. Neither can we. Which is why. Which is why we aim to liberate all of the sushi gates in the land. Our end goal is a world where anyone who wants sushi can have it. What a wonderful world that would be. Then we're in. That's a cause worth fighting for. Come on. Plus, going after the Empire means we're bound to find Franklin. And that's our goal. Welcome to the Resistance. You're having a strategy. I'd like to have your involvement. But first, consider a few sushi spikes and select one to ally with. Cool. So we're getting another... We'll get we'll have three then, I guess, sushi spikes total, right? Oh, getting yes. one more here? We're asking a lot of you, so we must make sure you're ready to bear it. Okay. One option. Sushi shield. The alternative. The ledger zap. Feel free to pick whichever sushi hmm. sprite you like. We're gonna go with the shield, Elican. Got it. Probably our best bet. I'm thinking that. But who knows? I guess either or would be fine. But so we'll have three sprites now, guys, which we can swap the order out of whatever we need to. Doesn't really matter per se. Look at that. Nom 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 nom. <laughs> Makes a good thumbnail right there. He loves his sushi. You befriended the sushi spread? Elecon. Its skill is sushi shield. What level are you, buddy? Congratulations on earning your third pledge. You're a prosperous sushi striker now. Sushi battles are meant to be fought with three sprites. Their skills will take you far. So we have the shield, that's good. But all I really need to do uh, to win is to eat like crazy. Hmm. I admit. Good grief. Well there's probably not much damage you can do with Jinrai yet. Wait. Why does that jacket look so Uh oh. <laughs> it seems Yabba isn't far from uh, fall far from the tree. So he must have known where the jacket came from, huh? Hmm. That's kinda cool. Jinrai. Imperial Palace. Wow. They're sending everyone in to capture Jinrai. The Sushi Armies. <laughs> Seems you have failed us, Kodiak. Jinrai slipped through your fingers. I, I messed up. You gotta let me take another run at it. Tell me, who does Jinrai serve as his master? Uh. It was just some kid. <laughs> A kid? What was his name? Musashi or something. Just some kid. Not anymore. Musashi. He's a formidable sushi striker. That's us, by the way. <laughs> Chapter 2, The Shrine Grove. There we go. It's like kind of, uh, I guess that last battle was kind of like a boss battle in a sense, so. That's cool. Oh. What's this about a shrine grove? Oh, yes. It's a small, isolated island in the southern bay that's thick with overgrown forests. Within it lie the venerable ruins of ancient sushi monks. Hence the shrine grove. Indeed, you might think of it as. <laughs> a spiritual home for us. There is that place. Jinrai has such a powerful, deep voice. It's kind of funny. They're in that place of supreme mystical energy. Sushi sprites can hone their power. It was once protected by vigilant villagers. But the Empire occupied it in the struggles. However, the Sushi Liberation Front has vowed to reclaim it as our headquarters. Well, hmm. well. Striking a blow to the Empire and bolstering our forces at the same time. A sound idea. Isn't it? I thought so, anyway. It sounds great, but where do I come in? In that case, Musashi. I'm glad you asked. 
You have a special job to engage the enemy away from our forces. <laughs> kind of the pawn here. The Empire is aware of Jinrai now, putting you squarely in their sights. While all eyes are on you. My forces will have room to work. Are you implying... Our job is to be bait. I'm sorry. Oh, wow. If you say so, sure. Relax, Chief. Anything for the SLF. Really? We're all in here at this point, guys. So let's go. Making sure we have all the three sprites. There we go. That's good. Sushi shield. All right, now. All right, just making sure. So we're almost at level six, by the way. That's cool. Let's go into our first battle with these three sprites. Here goes. <laughs> we just slide in here. This is the kid with Jinrai. What have I gotten myself into? Mm -hmm. So you've heard of me, huh? <laughs> all cocky. This goofball doesn't know. Does he not know all publicity is good publicity? I'm with the Hunter Division. I may look into a cut like a common soldier, but don't be fooled. Oh yeah? What's so hot about the Hunter Division? Glad you asked. Our squad sushi sprite skill is the hidden plate trick. <laughs> Pay no mind if you see me stacking more plates than I ate. I can beat you easy. Not that a striker needs to play dirty to win. We're tough enough on our own. Here I come. Clean your plates! So here we go, guys. Looking out for the hidden plate from them. So they'll gain more plates than they actually eat. Okay. Let's rock and roll here. 101, 101st Division. Put the shield up. This is a long battle here. Let's see here. Come on, we can do it. I think so, anyway. Finishing strike. All right, not bad. Took longer than I wanted to, though. Uh, we need to get better combos. So 
It's always like the middle of the battles, like I kind of slow up a little bit from the beginning. Yeah, great D, not very good. So we cleared two of the stars, though. Um, we just agreed was bad. So not bad. We used the Sushi Shield twice, too, which is pretty cool. Not bad for our first try using the three sprites, so there we go. Experience Charm, that's good. Leveling up here. That's great. Almost level seven. All right, new raw power, Salmon! Very cool. I'll take that. Why do I feel so charged up? And that's raw power, Masashi. It's the mark of a true sushi striker. All sushi contains a hidden power within. Of one type of sushi, its unique ability will flow into them. Hmm. Another ability, like on top of all the ones the sushi sprites give me? That's cool. That's right, the power of your favorite sushi will activate automatically during battle. Oh. Yes. Your declared favorite sushi is listed on the data screen. So there we go. Huh. Bottom line, you're saying I should pick my favorite sushi, right? There we go, now we can pick it. There we go. Did it pick it for us or was it just showing us what to do? Didn't have time to think very hard on this one. My favorite is Salmon. Indeed. Salmon's raw power is Atax. For low on health? Nice. Even on your last legs, you can deliver a powerful strike and pull through. It's that last little ugh that we needed. I like that. So next episode, we'll head into Shrine Grove Path 2. So it picked that for us. That's cool. Awesome. All right. I'm going to make sure it actually did that and did. So let's also level up with the item that we had, the charm, before I forget. Get that shield sprite elecan up. All right. And that will end this episode, guys. Make sure you blast the like button for us, comment below, and subscribe. I'm Eddie Ray for NintendoChitChat.com. We'll catch you guys back here next time.